years, the Victory Christian Single Parent Ministry has been serving Thanksgiving dinner to single parent families. Seven years ago, they opened their doors to everybody, including out-of-state college students. Two News photojournalist Lee Carter takes us to the feast and shows us why everyone is thankful for the organization. We are so glad that you all are here with us today. So let's start from the line. Father, we just thank you for today. We started doing this over 10 years ago. We thank you for this Thanksgiving holiday. When people came to us that they have nowhere to go on Thanksgiving Day, they just stay home depressed and nobody invited them. So I rented a clubhouse that, that will hold 25 people. Within one week, I got over 300 RSVP. We thank you for each and every life here. We end up serving over 300, 350 people every year. But this year looks like it's going to be bigger. Is that too much or is that good? Because of the recession, whatever is going on, a lot of people can maybe afford to do anything. Financial reasons. I'm a media student. I'm from Dayton, Ohio, and I didn't have the, uh, the funds to go back for Thanksgiving. Shani, what's your major? I'm a graduate student at ORU. I'm from Texas. I wasn't able to get back to Texas, but um, I wanted somewhere to go, and voila. My favorite part is when I look at these people and I see smiles on their faces. We're glad you're here, man. I feel like I'm uh, back at home a little bit. It makes me feel at home being here. We thank you for this time of fellowship. I would probably be stuck in my apartment working on papers. I plan to Skype the family later and uh, talk to them, but otherwise it would just be uh, at home in a lonely apartment. Father, we thank you, Lord, for answering every need. The most important thing is, you know, making sure that all these people are fed and loved. Amen. Lord bless you. That's so neat. Well, we want to remind you our annual Food to Families Food Drive is now underway. We're teaming up with Reesers, Tulsa's Federal Credit Union, and the Boy Scouts of America. We're collecting food right outside of our station in Tulsa's Brookside neighborhood next Friday from 10 until 6 p.m. Or you can drop off your donations at any Reesers or Tulsa Federal Credit Union, and all the food goes to the Community Food Bank of Eastern Oklahoma. And we love it. I'm going to be there next week.